we say thank you for yesterday. Daddy, we say thank you for today. Thank you for the one you are going to do tomorrow, O oh Lord. Thank you for all the celebrants, O oh Lord. Daddy, will bless your holy name, O oh Lord. Daddy, we cover all those celebrants with the blood of Jesus, O oh Lord. We cover this testimony also with the blood of Jesus, O oh Lord. Thank you, faithful Daddy. Thank you, blessed Redeemer. In Jesus' powerful name, we have given thanks. eating and celebrating and I know that happens today I'm just going to end up with uh, I my shouts I, I will call my mother in Nigeria today anyway to say happy birthday mom that is a great one uh, we celebrate to you mom uh, Rev, uh, senior reverend uh, mother alone who okay be alone who we bless God for your life it's a long journey that you are just started by God grace you will see uh, the children of Andrew Amen. and others in the name of Jesus in good in good health. Do you know do you know why I told my wife my children this? You know why I said this? Bible said Abraham died at old age and he did not seek. He just slept and that's all. Hallelujah. Amen. And God will do greater things than that for our mommy in the name of Jesus. Amen. We thank God for her life. I met with her last year. We could not go this year anyway. Pleasant woman, I'm telling you. <laughs> Smiling like a like a, a they tell me too. Yeah. Hallelujah. We thank God for her. God, the Lord will sustain her. Yeah. The Lord will bless her in the name of Jesus. She's blessed already. I'm blessed. We call her blessed in the name of Jesus. For our brother, Barista, we thank God. Thank God for your life. I uh, thank God. Even that this year, uh, birthday is meeting here in America. The first birthday in America, right? Glory be to God. Glory be to God. It's going to be full of talking and other things. God. We up to uphold you in the name of Jesus. As you are celebrating today, the Lord will give you testimony in the name of Jesus. We pray that this will be a beginning of great things in your lives, in your family, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Brother Ade Tonna. That brother was the person that print all our flyers. All these things, all the doors were just to, all these ones, one that designed and print everything. Hallelujah. I saw him. He came here last, last year, right? Okay. And uh, I told him, I said, he's going to be the next uh, of Gebu day very soon. You will see. One day, we'll just see me. I'll we'll just see me in Gebu. They say, I've come to greet my friend over. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. The Lord will grant you long life. The Lord will sustain you. You go from strength to strength in the name of Jesus. And all glory, all honor to God Almighty Father. We thank you for this, our mommy. Thank you for the baby, and you know, all of them are growing one, 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 just like that. Just like Benjamin, we had the birth now. Benjamin, I thought Benjamin will be about eight months. I know, I don't know, he's going to be 10 years very soon. We thank God for his faithfulness in our lives. I pray for every one of them, they will go from strength to strength, from glory to glory in the name of Jesus. We will not, as we rejoice with them today, we never cry with their family in the name of Jesus. The light of God will shine into their lives in the name of Jesus. We bless God, we bless God. He's a good God, he's a faithful God. Thank you, Father. We bless God for his faithfulness. We thank God for the week. Hallelujah. We thank God for the week. Our God is faithful. We just bless God. I thank God for all the people. You know, he's so happy today. You know, he left house since uh, Friday. He is in the hotel rejoicing with, with his friend so since uh, Prince Friday. He says, come back on Thursday. I'll be when? Tuesday, okay. He died just from there to church. He's going back there when he finished. Hallelujah. You know, he was so happy. That is, I think that's the second time or first time. We thank God. You are a man already. You will not fall in the name of Jesus. We pray you go from strength to strength, from power to power in the name of Jesus. This year shall be a beginning of year in your life in the name of Jesus. We pray for you and everyone celebrating this month that your best years are ahead of you in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. God bless you. Our brother, we thank you. You are welcome. We appreciate you. You know what is going on in the country. We, we cannot shake you, but we know you are our, you are our guest. Amen. God bless you. The Lord will sustain you in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen and amen. We serve a living God. Our God is faithful. Hallelujah. Our God is wonderful. He's the Alpha, is the Omega. Shall we rise? As choir will help me with this song.
Hallelujah. Ancient of death, as old as you are, as old as you are, you will never change. Ancient of death, as old as you are, as old as you are, you will never change. Shades of days as old as you are, as old as you are, you will never change. Shades of days as old as you are, as old as you are, you will never change. Shades of days. As old as you are, you will never change. The shadow of death will thank you. You bless your holy name. The most high God will thank you. That I will say thank you. Arigwajo, we magnify you. We bless you, Jesus. The unchangeable changer will lift up your name. We bless you, Lord. God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, we magnify you. Hallelujah. The all-knowing God, we bless you. Hallelujah. You are good. Yes, Lord. And your mercy endure yes, forever. Daddy. Bless you, be to your name, Lord, in Hallelujah. the name of Jesus. Amen. We thank you, Daddy, for last week. Thank you, Jesus. We thank Almighty God this month of December. Thank you, Daddy. A notable month to be remembered. Oh, yes. Thank you for the testimonies. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for, for, for the month of celebration. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Almighty God, because you are the Alpha, you are the Omega. Oh, yes. You are the beginning, you are yes, the ending. Lord, yes, Lord. But by yet, you have no ending. Oh, yes. Glory and honor be to your Hallelujah. name, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Baba, you are wonderful. Amen. Lord, you are faithful. Amen. Blessed be to your name, Lord, in the name Amen. of Jesus. Hey, what shall I say unto the Lord? All I have to say is thank you, Lord. What shall I say unto the Lord? All I have to say. You are, you are the pillar that sustains our lives. Oh, yes. Lord, we lift up your name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Almighty God, for the journey of our lives. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you, Daddy, for your protection over this ministry. Thank you, Father. Ah, Daddy, even concerning this global storm, ah, you remain faithful to us. Oh, yes. Father, we thank you. Thank you, Jesus. You are our dwelling place. Yes, Lord. And Father, we thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, you are our shepherd. Oh, yes. Our provider. Yes, Lord. Our sustainer. Yes, daddy. All glory. All, wave Hallelujah. your hand to God. God, wave your hand to Him. Hallelujah. Tell Him how good it is. Wave Hallelujah. your hand to God. Hallelujah. 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 Bless the beat on Him, Lord. Thank you, our Father. Thank you, Jesus. We magnify you. Oh, bless you, Lord, Jesus. this morning we go into Your Word. Your Word represents You, Father. For what I done last Sunday, we lift up Your name. Hallelujah. Lord, this week has continued with us. Lord, we want to thank You. Lord, that you will explain your word. Amen. You will interpret your word. Amen. Your word will take root in the life Amen. of your people. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, we, pray, we make an adjustment. What we do, we are ready to make it in the name Amen. of Jesus. Thank you, our Father. Thank you, Daddy. Lord, I submit to you. Yes. I surrender to you. Hallelujah. Father, I paralyze every flesh in me. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. As the Holy Spirit have your way. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. let your name be glorified. Amen. Thank you, our Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you our God. Thank you. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Before you sit down, just uh, your building offering. Hallelujah. Your building offering.
Lord, we give you praise. Blessed be to your name, Lord, in the name of Jesus. You are wherever you are, God. That your children is not to build for you. Father, I pray as many are uh, tenants, Lord, with, the, with, with this offering we connected, we, we connect with you. That you will make us a landlord in year 2021 in the name of Jesus. As many that are writing right now, Lord, with this offering, you transform their lives. You bless the work of their hands. You will sustain them in the name of Jesus. Lord, we pray. Lord, for what you are doing in our life in this ministry, we pray, Almighty God, that by year 2021, we will be in our own place of worship in the name of Jesus. Thank you, our Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. God, put your offering. Hallelujah. Amen. Oh, open the Bible with me. As you do that, as you're doing that, open the Bible with me. Ah, oh, to the book of Genesis chapter 37, from verse 18. Don't sit down. Genesis 37, from verse 18. I will read verse 18, you read 19. By 20, when we get to 28, we all read together. Hallelujah. Are you there? Praise the Lord. And when they saw him afar off, even before he came near unto them, they conspired against him to slay him. Come now, therefore, and let us slay him, and cast him into some pit, and we will say some evil beasts had devoured him, and we shall see what will become of his dream. And Reuben said unto them, Shed no blood, but cast him into this pit that is in the wilderness, and lay no hand upon him, that he might read him out of their hands to deliver him unto his father. And they took him and cast him into a pit, and the pit was empty. There was no water in it. And Judah said unto his brethren, What profit is it if we slay our brother and conceal his blood? Want to go? Then they, are, they passed by a Medanite, a merchant man, and they drew and lifted up Joseph out of the pit and sold Joseph to Ishmaelite for twenty pieces of silver. And they brought Joseph unto Egypt. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless his word in the name of Jesus. I'm continuing. Have your seat. I'm continuing on where we stopped last, uh, last Sunday. The topic that I call dealing with destiny sinkers. And because of some people were, that were not here last week, or, or were not online last week that are here today, uh, I will go back to the introduction. And I put it this way in my note. I said, by now, those of us who have been following up for some time, we have know what uh, our, our destiny is. Hallelujah. And for the sake of those who are not here, I, I want to go back to that again. Then, what is destiny? Destiny is the reason. Is the reason why God brings brings you into this world. Destiny is what is written concerning you before you came to this world. Destiny is the purpose of God for, your, for you before you came into this world. Number four, you're, you, are a dest, you, are dest, you are destined into your family for a reason. Hallelujah. You are destined to your family for a reason. Hallelujah. In the uh, in first Samuel chapter 17, 29. First Samuel 17, 29. And David said, What have I done? Is that not a cause? Is that not the reason that I'm in this family? Is that not the reason that you are in this church this morning? Is that not the reason that you are alive today? Is that not the reason, reason that you are in that place where you walk? Hallelujah. So there's a reason for your destiny. Somebody shout hallelujah. Destiny is the intention of God for, for your life. <laughs> hey, 
Hallelujah. And enemies, they fight with everything. They are not, let like hear this. Enemies are not fighting against you because of what you have already. They are fighting against you because of what you will be for greater things that are ahead of you. And I said something in my, when I was preparing this thing, something dropped in my heart that these people, they did not hate or uh, brethren, brethren of Joseph did not hate that or hate him because of his, uh, or, of, of his father's love for him. They hated him because of what he will be tomorrow. Is anybody listen to me? Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's why we pray against evil observers. People, there are some people, what they do in life is that they observe. They, are, they, are, they observe us. Sometimes, sometimes we call them star gazers. They look at, at, at your star. And they can predict what's going to happen. So I pray for everyone at the sound of my voice this morning. Every standing observer, I smack them with blindness in the name of Jesus. Amen. See, they are busy, but they don't, they don't have anything they are doing. They are, they are just observing lies. Hallelujah. The brother of Joseph did not hate him because, yes, because of their father's love for him. But because of what God has in stock for him, because of his tomorrow. They want to hinder him from getting to tomorrow. They want to hinder that plan to, to, become to, uh, to, to be made manifest. And I pray for someone this day by the power in the blood of Jesus. Every power manipulating your destiny or fighting against your destiny, heaven will sink them in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Every household enemy fighting against your star, I command heavens to, to, to destroy them in the name of Jesus. Amen. I command heaven to destroy them in the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray this day by the power in the blood of Jesus. Amen. Every household enemy fighting against your destiny, I command heaven to give them useless assignment in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you for saying big amen. That, well, you know what the big, uh, when, what, what is a big assignment? When they are thinking of hitting you or do something in your life, hindering your movement, God gave them headache. They, are big, they begin to struggle with that while you are moving on. Say, I'm moving on. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Like I said in part one of this topic, that destiny can be killed, destiny can be res resisted, destiny can be caged, destiny can be swallowed up, destiny can be delayed, destiny can be paralyzed, destiny can be aborted. I'm telling you. So, notice your life. Ah, because you see somebody there. Ah, they are, they, 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 the star is booming. Oh, that person has to pray. I follow, we must pray. So that enemy will not abort our destiny in the name of Jesus. Amen. For example, hear this. In the book of Song of Solomon, chapter 2, verse 15. Song of Solomon, chapter 2, verse 15. says, look at it. It take us, it says, take us the foxes, the little foxes that spoil the vine. For our vine have, have won tender grapes. You see that? There are foxes and lawns. Solomon, Solomon is the wisest man that ever lives. He was saying, he will have a garden of good grapes. Your destiny is beautiful. Your destiny is, oh, it's, uh, it's wonderful. Hallelujah. But there are foxes around the garden that can destroy the grapes. These foxes, if you don't, if, if don't take care of them now, they will not allow the garden to flourish. So, so, so each time, you see, there, there, there are foxes, enemies around our destiny. In our family, in our, in our, among our friends, in, our, in the schools. So you must take care of these foxes. So if the foxes are there, there's no, there's no, no, no way the grape can will, 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 will be flourish. Hallelujah. I pray for someone here I mean, this morning. Every evil plantation, growing contrary to the will of God in your lives, I approve them in the name of Jesus. Every contrary foxes, every contrary plantation, they are planted to grow against your destiny, that delay your destiny. I paralyze them in the name of Jesus. I approve them in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I pray for you this day. Every power assigned to terminate your destiny halfway, I command destruction upon them by power in the name of Jesus. By authority in the blood of Jesus. Ah, I say every power assigned to terminate your life halfway, I terminate them in the name of Jesus. I terminate them in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I pray by the authority of God this morning. Hallelujah. Hey, that you will fulfill your purpose on earth in the name of Jesus. You purpose, will fulfill a God's plan for your life this week in the name of Jesus. Hey, like I said before, destiny is totality or summary of your existence. 
Your destiny is totality of, of, of why you are alive. No another thing. Hallelujah. <laughs> My question is this. Is everyone born into this world that manifests their destiny? Is it everybody? No, the answer is no. Why? Because of the little foxes that are in the camp but not taken care of on time. Those small, small things are the thing that hinders destiny. Those foxes, those satanic plantations. You remember what Jesus said? Jesus said, the, 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 he, he, he said every tree. No, he, he, he made, a, he, he made a, a parable. He heard this parable. He said, a farmer went to a farm and he farmed everywhere. Every, everything cleared the bush and, and he, 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 he put his plantation there. When he woke up in the morning, next day, there are tears. Those tears grew up. And the, 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 the servant of the farmer said, ah, Say, Master, but we planted good, good seed in this, in this tree. Where did this tears, tears came up? He said, The enemy has done this. And the people said, Oh, can we, can, can we just approve it? I said, No, don't approve it now. Let, let, let it grow. So, what am I saying today? There are plantations, there are evil plantations. And I put it today, every plantation in your destiny. Be consumed by the fire of God in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Hmm. If you come to this world and you don't fulfill your destiny, you are your blood animal is better, better than that person. If you come to this world, your destiny, hear me, children, your destiny is not fulfilled, that person is, is worse than animal. Because God can take him off at any time. I can go there and we are not talking of that today. That is why I said last week, destiny is to be discovered, pursued with every energy in you and guide it wisely. Don't joke with your destiny. Don't play with your destiny. That, that, that is what's wrong. Uh, if, even, though they were, they, even though they have said before, in the, uh, 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 prophecy has, has went ahead of Esau and, uh, and, 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 uh, and Jacob. But you can still guide, you can guide, yeah, let me tell you, you can guide against satanic vision, satanic revelation. For your, you also know, I, I will not say my bad right. But carelessly, his soul is bad right. That will not be your portion in the name of Jesus. The plan of God for mankind in Isaiah 60, 1 to 2 says, are you there? Isaiah chapter 60, verse 1 to 2. This, this is the plan of God for, man, for, for every man on earth. Arise, shine, for the light is come, and the glory of the Lord is risen upon you. Amen. That is what, that's what God is doing like. God wants to arise and shine. But I pray for you today. Every power place hand upon your star. That hand be withered away in the name of Jesus. Every house of enemy planning to hinder your star from being manifest, from being shine. I command them to sing to wither away in the name of Jesus. But what am I saying today? God has a plan for you. God wants you to manifest. And God, look at what he said in verse 2. For behold, the darkness shall cover the earth and gross darkness the people. But for me, look at it in your Bible. Say, but the Lord shall rise upon me. Hallelujah. And his glory shall be seen upon my life. Somebody shout hallelujah. It doesn't matter what is happening right around you. It doesn't matter the darkness you are seeing around the world. It doesn't matter the storm you are seeing around the world. The Bible said the light of God will shine upon you in the name of Jesus. Because why? You are a child of light. And the light will shine in your life. Will shine to your family in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Plan of God for us, his children, is to arise and shine, to show forth his glory. Hey! <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. To shine even in the midst of darkness. You hear that? God wants you to shine in the midst of, in the midst of darkness. And if you must do everything in your life to shine because your destiny in your hands, in your hands. Even though God is the pillar that sustains us, he has done his own work. He's a covenant keeping God. Brother, you must do everything to shine in your generation. Hallelujah. Hmm. But let me quickly tell you this. There are powers within and without that, that will hinder you, hinder ones, not manifest, not shine. Not that those powers are there, but I pray tonight, this day. Ah, Father, that Father, every, every power within and without, challenging God's purpose in your lives. Heaven will challenge them in the name of Jesus. Every power within and without. Ah, that's one to hinder or challenge purpose of God in your lives. I come out on that to strike them to death in the name of Jesus. 
you must manifest God's plan for your life in the name of Jesus. But these people, <laughs> I'm telling you, when you look at what is happening around you, you will realize like, wow, what high high is this happening? Everyone, here number one, everyone born into this world were born with a glorious destiny. It has, it has not to do with what you are going through right now. You are born with what? A glorious destiny. You are, you are not created empty. I'm telling you, you are not an empty vessel. Even the world itself is not created empty. Do you know that? The Bible said the earth, in Psalm 24 verse 1, said the earth is the Lord and fullness thereof, and, they have, and the world and they that dwell in therein. God did not create anything without a purpose. God, what does that say? Here, that's again. Maybe that we take that home tonight, this morning. I think God did not create everything without a purpose. Everything God created, God has a purpose for it. Hallelujah. Amen. Look at what the Bible says. In Psalm number 8, verse 4 and 5. Psalm 8, 4 and 5. Say, so what's a man that thou art mindful of him? God, God is mindful of you. You are not accidental creation. God created you for a reason. Hallelujah. And the son of
Kahinda my destiny. Blue that shout hallelujah. Amen. Number two. Everyone that is born with glorious and colorful destiny. I will not I cannot be able to I cannot finish today anyway. Hmm. But everyone that is born with glorious and colorful destiny has this theory category of people around them. But we'll, I can maybe I can only talk up two today because of our time. You know, we have a time set and uh, um, I will not want to keep you because I know you have something to do. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. This particular group of people, I find that in the Bible everywhere. Hard number one, I call them destiny observers. Destiny observers, if you are taking note, destiny observers. These people are not always harmful. And we have seen many of them in the church here before. I'm telling you. That they are not harmful. Some, some call them spectators. They have an idea that you are going somewhere. They may not know where you are going. They don't know where you will, you will arrive. But because they don't know what will happen, you know what they, they but, but they want to stay around you. So, so when, when your glory begins to shine, you know what they will say? They will say, ah, uh, is that not telling me? Ah, we are, we are, we are, we are college, we are college, we are college uh, roommates. Ah, is that not the trial? Oh, yes. And when she was in London, we live in the same place. They, they, that's what they want. They want to stay around you. But they, are, they, 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 don't, they will not contribute anything to your destiny. Yes. They don't do anything to help you. And the, but they, they, they want to be a pali pali. In fact, I, I call them parasites. But, but why they are with you? They want to eat from you. They want to drink from you. As they are doing that, they are eyeing someone else that they are eating from. Those, those, those people, they are around people. You be, you, you, so until you begin to shine, then they can say, We are friends. Hey, and, and all these ones, they are there. There's some stuff, they say we are both some friends, you know. I live at Lakoka, and there's just a two building and separating us. We are, we, are, we, are, we, are, we, are, we are good friends. My father and his father, in fact, they, are, they, are, they, are, they went to the same church. That's what they say. That's why, that's what called observe the school. I call it observers. They observe your destiny. Hallelujah. Amen. Some people, you see, you are, you are, you are, are, they, are they, they, don't, they don't love you and they don't hate you, but they are just looking what they can gain from you, what they can get from you. Those are, those, those are, you see, you are not seeking because you love me. You, you, know, you know what Jesus said to them? These observers, I will tell you what happened to them. In the men in Jesus Christ in ministry. Jesus gave them food. When Jesus realized that, oh, they have been with me for a long time, God, Jesus prepared food for them to eat. Second day, they came to Jesus Christ. Jesus, when they came to him, Jesus said, yeah, you are not seeking me because you love me, but because of the food I gave you yesterday. So this type of people are around you because of what they can gain from you. However, you should not rely on them. I'm telling you, they can fly away. You will not put your trust in them at all. Those are, those, those are, one that, those, those are, those are called observers. Maybe I'll stop on number two because of time we pray. The, the second type of people that we, we, that we are around you if you have a colorful destiny are the people are called destiny wasters. These ones are dangerous. This one, you must not play with them. You must not hang out with them. I call them destiny wasters. And I want you to be careful of this group of people. Destiny wasters are everywhere. They are, they, they, are they are threatened by your dreams. I'm telling you. They are threatened by your dream. If you have them as a husband, begin to pray for change. I mean, you cannot leave your husband, but begin to pray for change. You have them as a wife, begin to ask God, God, intervene. Intervene. I'm entering into it already. Because God, you're, they're, 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 I've seen, even you have them as, as pastors. I've seen somebody who said, Ah, none of my members will be richer than me. I say, Wow. Then who you go to sponsor your ministry? You're, you're going to be struggling. Doesn't matter how money you have. Hallelujah. That's the way you understand. So, all those people, they are, they are, they are threatening with your dreams. You must be careful of them. You must not have anything to do with them. You must keep them at, 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 at a long distance. If they come near to you, they look looking for information. Let me give you an example. Genesis chapter 37 verse 20. Look at it. I said they are threatened, you are threatened, they are threatened by your dreams. Look at what they say. 20. 37, 20. Look at it. Come now, therefore, let us slay him 
and cast him into, the, into, into some pit. And we will say, some evil beasts have before him. And we shall what? I beg read with me, church. And we shall what? You see, you see the, 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 the dreams of Joseph already give them problems. The dream of, the dream of Joseph is already threatening their, their own lives. The, 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 the dream of Joseph is a problem to them. They don't check for their own lives. They don't face their own problems. They are facing the destiny of someone else. This is his dream. What is dream? You have not said anything, brother. You will hear. hear. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Okay, what, what are this king? King Herod in the Bible. Who, when, the, when, when the people saw the star of Jesus Christ, a newborn baby that has not done anything, and they, that they were looking for the star, they got to Herod, Herod Palace. They saw a king has born. You say, a king has been born? What a king. I mean, it did, his, his understanding did not tell him to, that it will take another 30 years for this man to reign. Bible says he killed everybody in that age. The spirit of Herod. The, the dream of Jesus was strengthening him. He's threatened by the dream of others. So this destiny wasters, they are threatening with other people coming up. Say, ah, that new politician, no, it's not going to anywhere. It will end up at, 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 at that local area. That musician, that's where it will end. They do everything to hinder them. Jesus was yet to be born. Just a, a, a day child boy that still have many years to live before he will manifest the glory of the people, before he become king. Even though he was born king, right? But this man, because of the dream of Jesus Christ, he could not hold on himself. But not about Jesus right now. Look at how many lives he wasted away. The Bible say, from eight to years downward, he killed everyone that was born in, 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 that, in that period. So, so, so your, your, your dream threatened them. That's why you must, you must be able to keep your word to yourself. Hallelujah. Destiny waster is not something to joke with. Destiny waster sometimes come as a friend to bring an obstacle on your destiny. They waste people's destiny with an irrelevant things. They waste people's life then with an irrelevant things. Let me hear. Let me tell you this. This is not a joke. If you are a lady, you are you, are, you have a, a, a boy. You have come to a boyfriend. You are going out with you, and he, he did not propose to you. Leave that person and go away. They are destiny wasters. Everybody, everybody around you knows already that you, you are going out with this guy. And everywhere you go, in your car, in, in his car, you are there, in your heart, you are going out and coming and refuse to propose to you. And what you what you just, just came to you, come to you with is a wedding invitation. You say, ah, but I thought we were in a relationship. You say, ah, but it's too late. So those people, they, they, they are in your life to waste your destiny. Don't joke with them at all. They have nothing to do. In fact, you're about to call them one name. Or tied in your tie, uncle. They are the enemy of man and uh, an enemy of the animal. You know what they do? They carry gun. They, they dress as a hunter. And they, go, they went to the farm or to the bush. They did not kill the animal. They, they, they did not allow people to kill the animal. An animal, we call them enemy. He ran away. And even the man, the, the people at the house say that man is so stingy. He has sold all his enemy, all his animals in the, that he killed. So we call them or tied in your the enemy of man and the enemy of animal. So just people run for them your life. Because they are, they, are, they are there to waste your life. They are there to waste your precious time. They will give you a lot of things. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> every, waste, every waste of destiny. Hovering around you, I separate from them in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every destiny wasters hovering around your life, around your uh, around your vicinity. Ah, I separate from them in the name of Jesus. Destiny waster can can do anything to waste the destiny of their victim, and they're everywhere. They're in the marriage, they're in the marketplace, they're in your place of work, they're in the school. So don't say, uh, don't don't say, uh, no, no, they're in the family. We remember the man we used last week as our test case. So this, this week now, we used Joseph, right? Last week, we used uh, Samson as our test case. Hallelujah. In the book of Judges, chapter 16, 4 to 6. Hallelujah. Amen. And it came to pass, afterward, that he loved a woman in the valley of Sorak, whose name was Delilah. We know the story. I don't want to go back. Verse 5, right? Okay. 4 to 4, okay. 
And the, the Lord of the Philistine came on, 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 up unto her and said unto her, unto her, and touch him and see where his great strength lies, and by what means we may prevail against him, that we may bind him to afflict him, and we will give thee a, a very, uh, the, every one of us, 1,100 pieces of silver. Hey! I, I preach it someone here some time ago. I said, my destiny is not for sale. <laughs> hey, hey, satanic bargain. Concerning somebody's destiny. They were bargaining for his destiny. And the Lord said to Samson, tell me, I pray thee, where, where then the great strength light, and where will thou might be, be bound to be to afflict thee? Hallelujah. Amen. Go, go to 15 to 20. Somebody let me to read. 15, 20, loud. And she said unto him, Yes. How canst thou say, I love thee, mm -hmm. when thine heart is not with me? You see? Thou hast loved me these three times, and hast not told me where in the great strength lies. And it came to pass, when she pressed in vain with their word, and hurt him, so that his soul was very unto death, that he told her all his head, all his heart and said unto her, There has not gone a razor upon my head, for I have been a Nazarite unto God from my mother's womb. If I be shaven, then my strength will go from me, and I shall become weak and be like any other man. Hallelujah. Have your seat, man. Because of our time. We know this story already. This, <laughs> Samson's destiny was wasted because of the waster of destiny assigned to him. You are going to put your right hand on your head. Say, Father. Father. Every assignment of the, uh, evil over my, over my life. Every assignment of darkness over my life. <laughs> Be paralyzed in the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice and cry to God. Brethren, you are not praying. Hey! Destiny of something was, was, was negotiated. Destiny of someone was bargaining for. Ah, Father, in the name of Jesus. The evil assigned, assigned that woman as a wife, assigned it to the life of, that, uh, of, 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 of something. Ah, Lord, in the name of Jesus. God of heaven and earth, I stand upon this altar. Father, in the name of Jesus. Every destiny was assigned to anyone's life. As I hear online, I palace your power in the name of Jesus. I give them lots of memory in the name of Jesus. I say, lose your memory in the name of Jesus. Lose your mind in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus, mighty now we pray. Amen. Abraham, I'm telling you, how can so, so you say so you say you love me and you have told me lies? But why are you asking my secrets? Hey, <laughs> hey, hallelujah. I think somebody we we write all this thing down so that you when it comes your way, mostly the younger ones, don't sleep. This is not time to sleep. Your destiny is in your hands. Hallelujah. Amen. Hey, that stuff western is not something to joke with, like something. Last times indeed. They are to be resisted. You are to run from them. You are to pray them away from your life. I will stop here this week. Because of our time. Let me tell you, but destiny wasters are everywhere. I, I'm giving you two right now. The two times you must run for. I remain one. And then I will tell you how, how do you operate. But these people, it's not something that you can joke with at all. Destiny wasters, they are in everywhere. They are in the school, among your friends, in your place of work. And that, what they will do, that, they don't always come as an enemy. No. They come as a friend. Even when devil, Satan wanted to deceive Adam and Eve, he, came as, he, did, not, he, did, he did not come as a snake, you know, right now. He, he came in as a friend. So, but be, be, beware of the environment. Be more important, beware of the children, your, 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 beware of the friends friend that your children are, are, are going out, not going out with. And if you, if you are a child of God, you are still befriending your, your best friend is the people of the world. No, you have, you have to, you have, your destiny is at stake. Well, they can do anything to bring you back. They can do anything to bring you back to the world where you left many years ago. So be careful when your best friend is in the world. And be careful. Who is your allies in life? This one they can they can put. Well, can you believe your wife? Look 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 at Delilah. It can be a man too. I, I can, I've seen a lot of things I can I can tell. You. Let me tell you, these evil friends, or or, or, or this uh, this type of friends, I've seen friends who take their friends to another place, 
say they want to in the minute they want they want to help them they are going to use their destiny they use that master and the man become useless on earth <laughs> brother <laughs> hey our time has fast pain and we thank god it's not in vain anyway Amen. so i want to encourage us that if there is anything you want to do in life your destiny is very important so as you look forward for to 2021, I don't, I don't want to do what you do this year, next year. Begin to look at your life. Many of us will say, ah, I, this morning, I don't want, I, I cannot go to church. Enemy is playing with your destiny. I'm telling you, your destiny, God is the pillar that sustains you. He's our sustainer, sustain us. But brother, you must be in his presence continually. By living a holy life, by living a faithful life, a life that will glorify God alone. And I pray we will wake up from our dream in the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray that this summer you hear today, we, we, we quicken your heart to know what to do and who to run for, who to wait for in the name Amen. of Jesus. And you will you, 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 you be watchful for the friends, that, 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 the, the, your family friends. What are they doing? What are they saying? What are they contributing to your lives? Even when that man, that woman call you as a friend, what is what is he or she, he or she saying to your life? What are the what what are what are your uh, discussion? Do we want the discussion glorify God or glorify man? Shall we rise? We are going to pray little, but those are going to be powerful. Hear this before you pray. Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the Bible says you pray. In the garden of the Gethsemane. The Bible said the, the sweat in his body is like a drop of blood. For your deliverance to take place, you must be very, very serious with your destiny. Don't joke with your destiny. If Joseph will be careless with his destiny, we don't believe what we are reading about, about him today. Joseph said, will I do this and sin against God? Will I do this and terminate my destiny? Your destiny is in your hand. You must fulfill God's plan for your lives. You are you are not a you, you are not an you are, you are not an animal. You created the image of God and you must demonstrate this image of God. God said you must shine and you must arise and shine. Shall we rise? Lift up your hands to God. Thank God this afternoon. Lift up your right hands to him. Give God a waving offering this afternoon. Just tell God how good he is. Tell God how wonderful he is. Tell him the, the journey of your life. Where God is breaking you. Where you are, where God is taking you to. Bless God because he's a faithful God. Thank God because he's the almighty God. He's the alpha and omega. He's the beginning and ending. Thank God because God has covered your destiny with his blood. That he, with his hand. That you are untouchable. In the name of Jesus. Begin to thank God because you have access to him. Through the blood of Jesus. But if you are online, you are not born again. Give your life to God. And then God can defend your destiny. Give your life to God. So that God can fight for you. Hallelujah. Thank you, our Father. Thank you, our God. Blessed be your name, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. We want to pray to on this day against power that fight against our destiny. We are going to pray, Father. Father. Every assignment of evil, every assignment of darkness upon my destiny, I terminate your assignment in the name of Jesus. I terminate your assignment in my life, in my family. In the name of Jesus, say, My Father, my God, every assignment of evil, every assignment of darkness upon my destiny, I terminate your assignment in the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice, begin to terminate the assignment in your lives, that of your children, in the name of Jesus, my God and my Father, in the name of Jesus. Heavenly God, I cry to you today by the power and the blood of Jesus. You have a plan for me, my destiny is in your hands, Father. I must arise and shine. So, therefore, Lord, in the name of Jesus, every assignment of darkness, every assignment of evil upon my lives, upon my destiny, Lord, I cancel it in the name of Jesus. I terminate it in the name of Jesus. I terminate it in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Hey, cry this, we say, Father. Father. Every power higher to truncate my destiny. Every power higher to truncate my destiny. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I incur the wrath of God upon you. I incur 
the wrath of God upon you. In the name of Jesus, lift up your voice. Ah, fire of God, begin to burn them. In the name of Jesus, every power hired to truncate my destiny, to waste my destiny, ah, I incur the wrath of God upon you. In the name of Jesus, I incur right now, this afternoon, the wrath of God upon you. In the name of Jesus, thank you, my Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Brother, hear this. <laughs> The word is evil. I'm telling you. How can they, they went to go and hire somebody's wife? Tell me the secret of your husband. And now, and now in our one day, we have seen people go to evil prophets. People going to, to food, foodus. Kiss so and so for me. So that we don't get to that position. Hey! Christ to say, Father, every power hired to truncate my destiny. Every power, power hired to waste my destiny. I incur the wrath of God upon you. In the name of Jesus, I paralyze your memory. I paralyze your memory. Lift up your voice, brother. You are not praying. Masa dan kaya ba, meso dan kaya pa 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 pa. Repo sen dan kaya ba 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 ba. Lepo san dan kaya bo. Father, in the name of Jesus, every power, every power, every man, every power hired, every man, woman hired. Lord, to waste my destiny, to truncate my destiny. Oh, I I incur the wrath of God upon you. In the name of Jesus, be consumed, be destroyed by thunder fire of God. In the name of Jesus, be destroyed and be consumed by the fire of God in the name of Jesus. I paralyze your memory in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Put your two hands on your head. Say, say waste of destiny. I touch the, the foundation of my life. Be consumed by thunder fire of God. Hey, say my father, my God, waste of destinies attached to the foundation of my life. Be consumed by thunder fire of God. Be consumed by thunder fire of God. Be consumed by thunder fire of God. In the name of Jesus. Brethren, you are not praying. Father, in the name of Jesus. God of heaven and earth, in the name of Jesus. God, I pray. In the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, I pray. Waste of destiny attached to the foundation of my life. Be consumed by the fire of God. Be consumed by Thunder fire of God in the name of Jesus. Thank you, my Father. Thank you, my God. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Say, my Father and my God. Uh, every satanic, every satanic eyes observing my destiny. Smart be smart with the blindness. In the name of Jesus. Every evil eyes observing my destiny. Every satanic eyes uh, observing my destiny. Uh, I be smiled with blindness uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, be smiled with blindness uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, be smiled with blindness. Uh, lift up your voice, uh, brethren, and cry to God. Uh, smile down with blindness. They feel that they cannot see you. They will not observe your destiny in the name of Jesus. Uh, cry to God uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, my Father, my God, uh, my Father, my Maker. Every satanic eyes, uh, every evil eyes uh, monitoring my life. Uh, observe my life for evil. Be smiled with blindness. In the name of Jesus, I destroy your power. I paralyze your, 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 your effort in my life. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Hey, brethren, we want to go. We are going to pray. Say, Father, every, every demonic conspiracy to kill my destiny scatter in the name of Jesus. The plan is to kill something. I'm telling you, the plan is to kill something. The plan is, is that Joseph will not reach that goal. Uh, they said they want to see what, what will come of his dream. Lift up your voice and cry to God. Say, my father and my God, every demonic conspiracy to kill my destiny, scatter in the name of Jesus. My father, my God, every evil co conspiracy to kill the destiny of my spouse, satanic conspiracy to kill the destiny of my children. Father, in the name of Jesus, I scatter them with thunder fire of God. In the name of Jesus, I scatter them with thunder fire of God. In the name of Jesus, I scatter them with thunder fire of God. In the name of Jesus, my God and my maker, my God and my sustainer, God of heaven and earth, you are the man of war. You are the young that I am. Father, I call upon you, Lord. Every demonic conspiracy to kill my destiny, I clear you right now. In the name of Jesus, I scatter you but in the name of Jesus, by thunder fire of God. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, my Father. Thank you, my God. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Have we done the week? We want to pray for a particular sister. Hear me. She has a dream. It's not a palatable dream at all. We are going to cry to say, Father, 
every satanic animal assigned to afflict that sister in the dream. And in the name of Jesus, we reverse that dream. We kill that animal now. And in the name of Jesus, every satanic animal assigned to afflict that sister in her dream. Father, in the name of Jesus, I will reverse the dream. And we kill the animal now. In the name of Jesus. The effect of that dream, we neutralize it by the blood of Jesus. Be neutralized by the blood of Jesus. Be neutralized by the blood of Jesus. Be neutralized by the blood of Jesus. Every arrow of the enemy fire into her lies. With your boomerang, go back to your sender. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, my Father. Thank you, our God. Blessed be your name, Lord. We give you praise. We magnify you. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Let our children come to the front. All our children come to the front. Very late, very late, you are good. Very late, very late, you are good. Very late, very late, you are good. Jesus, you are good. Come on, church. Stretch forth your hands to these ones. Hallelujah. Okay. Okay. Stretch forth your to this one. Hallelujah. Okay. Yes. Can you guys come to order? All of you. Hallelujah. Mommy, daddy, send your hand to these ones. Hallelujah. And begin to ask God that every power assigned to, 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 to divide the destiny of these ones, we cast that power over their lives. In the name of Jesus. But they call something road that division, the one, the detour, detour in America, right? Detour. You see, this data, what it does is that it prolongs people's life. It prolongs their, it prolongs the journey of two, of two years. They can make it ten years. Hallelujah. That might be your portion in Jesus' name. We are going to pray for this one. Say, Father, we use these ones as part of contacts with all our children, wherever they are, both young and old. In the name of Jesus, every detour program to their lives to delay their destiny, to waste their destiny. We cancel it eh, by the blood of Jesus. We cancel it eh, by the blood of Jesus. All our children, wherever they are, you are unstoppable in the name of Jesus. You shall be a force to reckon with in the name of Jesus. You will be a light in your generation in the name of Jesus. You will represent God well in the name of Jesus. You represent your family well in the name of Jesus. Thank you, our Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. In that you are unstoppable. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Father, we thank you. Thank you Baba, we magnify Hallelujah. you. God will reference you. Hallelujah. You are the Almighty God. Yes, All power belongs to you. Hallelujah. No one like you. Yes, no one beside you. Thank you for what you are done, for what you are doing, for what you are yet to do. All glory, all honor to you. In the name of Jesus. Father in heavens, we're going to this week. Lord, we have heard your word. Our destiny is secure in you. So therefore, my Father, my God, Lord, in the name of Jesus, I cover every destiny with your blood in the name of Jesus. I cover every destiny with your blood in the name of Jesus. I pray in the name of Jesus, you are unstoppable in the name of Jesus. Nothing can hinder you. Nothing will hinder you in the name of Jesus. You will reach your goal in the name of Jesus. Thank you, our Father. Thank you, our God. Father in heaven, I pray that in the name of Jesus, for your protection, as your children go into this week, God of heaven and earth, that your presence will go with us in the name of Jesus. Lord, we pray you will protect us against every evil in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray that your hand will be on us for good in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. Lord, because you are our hiding place, thou shalt preserve us from every trouble. Thou shalt compass us about with song of deliverance in the name of Jesus. As we go in this, to, to this week, Father, you will instruct us and teach us the way to go. In the name of Jesus. We guard us with your eyes. In the name of Jesus. We can come back here on Sunday to, to jubilate, to celebrate in the name of Jesus. Thank you, our Father. Thank you, our God. All glory, all honor to you. In the name of Jesus. We bless you, our Father. We bless you, our God. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray.
Praise the Lord. Please offer your offering to God. Your offering and your tithes. Hallelujah. If you are hearing us or listening to us online, our it has not changed yet. Our giving our uh, system has not changed. 718 812 9816. If you are led to give to help the ministry on Cash App on Zell. Hallelujah. Or you want to pay through PayPal, you can use the, uh, the church email. Hallelujah. You can see it online already, has been typed on the line already. God bless you as you do in Jesus' name. Father, we want to thank you. Lord, we lift up your name. Thank you because you are good and your mercy endure forever. Thank for the much you are giving to us, to us, Almighty God. You have been our shepherd. You have provided for our needs. We have no cause to complain. Lord, we thank you. None of us are in the hospital. Lord, we lift up your name. Glory and honor be to your name, Lord. We are not on earth as of any member. Lord, we magnify you. But for the most you are given to us, we have brought our tithes. We are now with our offering before you. Father, in the name of Jesus, you will bless this offering. Use this for your glory. In the name of Jesus. As your children give here and online, we don't lack any good thing in the name of Jesus. The Lord will sustain you. The Lord will supply your needs. In the name of Jesus. So shall it be. And be so. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Can you just give your 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 uh, tight and offer as we as we close? Thank you, our Father. Blessed be the name. Oh, blessed be the name. Blessed be the name. Oh Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, blessed be the name. Oh, blessed be the name. Blessed be the name, O Lord. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name. Oh, blessed be the name. Blessed be the name, O Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, blessed be the name. Oh, blessed be the name. Blessed be the name. Hallelujah. Blessed be thy name. Blessed be thy name. Yes, Lord. Blessed be thy name. Oh, Lord. Hallelujah. Blessed be thy name. Blessed be thy name. Blessed be thy name. Oh, Lord. Finally, brethren. Finally, brethren. Wherever things are true. Whatever things are honest, whatever things are just, whatever things are pure, whatever things are lovely, whatever things are good report, if there be any virtue, if there be any praise, think on these things. Hallelujah. As you go home, begin to think on every word you have heard today and every Bible passage that you are being uh, quoted. Go back home and examine it if the pastor is right or is just reading from his own Bible. Hallelujah. Think of it and be a good person in the name of Jesus. Your right hand on your head. And the rest of my life shall be the very best of my life. The rest of my life shall be the very best of my life. The rest of my life shall be the very best of my life. So shall it be. And be so. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Then shall the earth yield her increase. And God, even our own God, shall bless us. You are blessed.